of Minecraft is up, fellas. It's Craft Guy Peter again. You already know what it is. I hope back once again to learn some hacks and do some tasks. Y'all got any crafts? Where crafts at? What are all the crafts on? Is this a craft? Does my hair look heckin' stupid, be honest? Today we're trying 29 handy dandy everyday life hacks just like mama used to make. This first one should be really epic and not stupid. All right, so I've got me freaking disgusting waste paper basket. <laughs> Over yonder. It's right there. Can you guys see it? You guys, you guys see what I'm looking at? Are you seeing what I'm looking at over there? Making sure we're all on the same page. Dude, that's a trash can. And it's freaking kind of gross, dude. But with the freaking power of Walmart, we can actually uh, combat that. This is how a freaking normal simpleton might try to do that. But then look what happens when I try to throw away my six pack of Coca-Cola. Wow! Yeah. Not only did I not successfully throw away this terrible, terrible beverage for you, I also broke the freaking garbage receptacle. Ow! <laughs> and now I broke it more. So they use these weird hooks to freaking secure their trash bag to their trash. That seems a little extra to me, if you know what I'm saying. And also, Mr. Krabs told me to stay away from those. So, I'm gonna put this bad boy in there. And we're gonna use tape. A little piece right there, and a little piece right there. And just to be safe. Now let's try this baby out. So this next one's for all you freaking five minute crafters who just got a busy full schedule and you still are passionate about the crafts that you want to make. So you gotta freaking squeeze in time to watch the videos whenever you can in the shower. You gotta watch it in the shower. You gotta get five minute crafts in the shower, baby. <laughs> Don't make it weird, dude. I know you freaking doing it in there. <laughs> Come on. It's squeaky clean. It's also good for watching Lonnie Dose videos in the shower. Better even. Just like the trash one though, I'm freaking not convinced that uh, that hook can do anything special that tape can't freaking do. This is gonna be good because then I can bathe and watch my program. Never want to mess with a man's programs, you know what? You know what, honey? God, this tape sucks. Keeps doing that thing where it becomes like 10 different strands of little unusable tape. God, I hate that. Don't you just hate that when you're trying to watch your programs in the bag? <laughs> you just put it, you just prop it up, prop put it there. Easy. And it's as easy as that, baby. Now you can freaking just get in the shower like a human boy. Surprising uses for everyday items, you say? I am intrigued. Color me intrigued. Color me intrigued because I am. Color me accurately to the way that I feel right now inside. I'm displaying it for you. What is a surprising use for an everyday household item? Do you just freaking take your salad dress and just pour it on your trousers? Do that? Surprise! The surprise was on me all along. Oh, oh no! Oh, this is not what I. This is so surprising! This is something that I super hate about these five minute crafts videos is they reuse the same crafts in different videos. So we've already done this one with the eyelash curler to open the bottle. Sometimes it works, sometimes it has it. Here's a freaking vlog clip of me and my girlfriend. We were in San Diego and actually had no bottle opener and tried to use an eyelash curler. Here, here, that curler. Here's what happened. Okay, five minute crafts has prepared me for this. I have an eyelash curler. I can make it work. They said it doesn't, but they also said it does. Big meaty claw! This doesn't feel like it gets under there. Turns out we're not having birthday cake soda because we don't know how to open it. I was just at McDonald's. Welcome to McDonald's. Can I take your order? Hi, can I just get one cheeseburger, please? You know, I know I don't say it enough, but thank freaking God that God himself invented rulers, dude. What would we do without them? Thank God also that they only freaking sell them by the pound. What am I gonna do with four rulers? What is anyone gonna do? It's not enough for an entire class, and it's way too many for a little boy like me. Anyway, let's freaking cut this sandwich the way only I, <laughs> the only way I know how. Take our McDonald's burger. You want to leave the plastic on a little bit. That's the... That's the, the secret, I, I guess. That's what they did in the video. This doesn't even have like the sharp edges, like you know how some rulers have that. So this is just wood. This is just, it's just a wooden stick that I'm gonna now. The heart of the cards. Oh. 
I think it, I think it's working, guys. You just gotta put your back into it. You gotta put your elbow grease into it. Put your entire body into it. I can smell the burger from here. Not just one premium prestige sli sliced burger. Sliced all the way through, daddy. Not, not perfect proportions, but I mean, come on. And now it's just so much easier to eat when you really think about it. Wow, that was easy. And I'm hungrier than I thought in real life even. To be fair, that is a very satisfyingly straight cut for a, just a ruler. <laughs> I mean, the pickle's kind of messing it up, but dang, dude. If knives never existed, this might actually make sense. I'm shocked by Coca-Cola. Dude, come on. What the hell does that even mean? Coca-Cola is not scary. Oh, oh, oh. If you listen closely, you can tell that the Cokes are mad at me. I would personally love to see if Coca-Cola can help me put out a fire. I thought you'd never ask. I mean, I don't know why it wouldn't, I guess. It's wet. It's not gasoline, pretty much. All right, you listen to me and you listen good. Don't you dare try this at home, okay? Because why? I got the freaking, I'm a freaking trained professional. I got the safety precaution gear to stop me from breathing and also breathing in the fumes of these dangerous chemicals. Also, I'm the boss here, so just don't do it. I'm locked out now. We'll see how this goes, dude. The freaking, this could, could go any way. Recording. Paper is flammable. Wind is not. Oh, no. Oh, dude, there's a fire going on. What do you, what do you know? I know I have just the thing. Oh, God. <laughs> This is why I told you not to try it at home. It's very messy. Not too dangerous though. As, as long as you're prepared, which I might have not been. It works. Oh yeah, Papa, I love giving me car a good polish. Some might, some people might actually take this as friggin' uh, making your car dirtier and not cleaner, but. Not me, not Craft Guy Peter. All right, so same as before. Do not try this but at home, not because it's dangerous, just because I don't want you to. And also, it's, it's about to rain, so it's the perfect time to freaking polish off the old paw mobile. I love when paw polishes me just like this. Well, bottoms up, boys. Tori, I didn't mean to polish your car with mine. Oh God, I didn't mean to polish everything, except the, the car, really. Oh yeah, you see what that's doing? That's eating away at all the grime, and it's also covering it in sugar. I think it's actually just doing the second part. Looks really good, honestly. It's, this is a good, it's a job well done. I'm not trying to be a douche. <laughs> But whether or not this works or not and does make your hair lighter, they sell stuff at the store that I guess is worse for your hair, but better for you to not be weird. Better in some ways, probably. It's not soda, so that that's a plus. And it probably d works better, almost certain. Only one thing left on the agenda. Gotta see if this hair color thing works. Don't blow up, don't blow up. Oh, oh, it's, oh it's cold. It's cold and bubbly, dude. I hope that lightened up my hair as much as it lightened me up as a person. I only have one left, so might as well do one more for old time's sake. Dude, my hair's gonna be so light! This is an awful video, I hate it. You can't even tell that I have any freaking pants on. Go catch some insects, boys. All right, for real though, do not try this one at home because bugs is scary. They're not even gonna see what's coming, dude. I'm gonna freak it. So what we're gonna, we're gonna put the coke on the floor, like so. <laughs> Just on the floor though, hopefully in the future next time. You stupid ass bugs, you're trapped now. They're gonna come get this coke and they're gonna be like, hey, I didn't think I was gonna be trapped when you were feeding me. And the joke's honestly on them. That's why they're covered in soda and not me, Craft Guy Peter. Removes chewing gum from what? What is that in their head? Just a freaking a bunch of human hair, dude? I don't think I have as much access to that as I might like. We're gonna freaking try this anyway. First we open our soda, which is gonna explode. That was a quick save. You go in there. No, you go in there. 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 Uh-oh. I told you it's mad at me, fella. Oh my god. Alright, we got our bowl of sin. 
tastes just like mama used to make. We got our gum. Yes, I'm just gonna chew this for a second. Then just like stick it to my hand, I guess. We'll even do a couple pieces. You know, they say to test your data a few times to make sure it's accurate, you know. This is good, I'm having a good time. <laughs> Trying to blow a bubble. <laughs> Well, I guess that's as good as we're getting. All right, so my hands are already feeling pretty significantly sticky as is. So what I'm personally hoping as a craft connoisseur is that when I plunge my fist into this bowl of straight up Coca-Cola, that my hand comes out feeling a little less sticky. Here we go. Something's happening. What witchcraft is this? Science kind, the sci- Bill Nye, the science witch men. Oh, I feel one of the gums falling off. Oh boy, I hope it doesn't take my skin with it. That'd be messed up. Anything for the greater good though, of the science community. Oh my, ew. I think it's all coming off. I think it's all coming off. I can see bone. Well, believe it or not, still sticky. <laughs> but I did get the gum off. It works, it works, guys. I just tested and busted. Quick life hack for you, everybody. Here's how to wash away some blood from your victims. What is going on at this headquarters? And why is the blood? I mean, I know why it's there in that spot pr precisely, but I mean, Come on now. I guess let's go try to use Coke to wash blood off. Got freaking Coke everywhere. All right, so we got our shirt. We got our case of real human blood. I keep on deck for any occasion. Oh, oh no, I bled all over me red shirt and this is a problem for some reason. You're not, dude, because not only do we have the freaking power of crafts, we have the power of Coca-Cola, which is gonna Explode. <laughs> You'd think this man would learn his lesson. I'm not gonna be taken for a fool again. I was taken for a fool again. I guess I should have watched the whole clip before I went outside and got blood on my clothes. <laughs> you just put the blood. <laughs> you put the coke on, on top of the blood. And then you just wash it and it should come out. The Coke does nothing. It's just kind of fun to spill it on there. Have two sta two stains are better than one is what they always say. God, freaking five minute crafts knows what's up, dude. They know how to freaking watch videos in ways that are slightly easier than just having a computer, I guess. Hold this gift card. Also, I'd like to point out this Starbucks gift card I'm using uh, claims that it is more than just a gift card. It's quite literally not. I mean, <laughs> it's a gift card. It's just a gift card, but it's about to be more than just a gift card. You're gonna freaking- All your dreams are about to come true, little piece of plastic with a woman on it. All right, so that, that looks kind of like what they had going on. I don't think this gift card is very sturdy. I don't think it's gonna work, guys. I think- <laughs> Maybe I did it wrong. Bummer. There you go, boys. I fixed it. No worries. So we're gonna give it a little snip here. Oh, oh. Thank you guys for watching another craft guy, Peter. Amazing video. This sounds extra bad because my real pick is still all right. Oh, actually, it fell out, but this one isn't very good. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully, you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit the like button. It helps me out a lot, and I always appreciate it. Hope you guys are having a cool New Year's. If you freaking want a cool gosh dang shirt like this, uh, you can get it at lottydose.com, baby. We got all kinds of designs up there now. It's getting fresh. It's getting cool. Yeah, I'll freaking see you guys soon. More vlogs, more games, more crafts, more goods. Okay, love you, bye. Here's what they did for their thumbnail that makes no sense to me. They took this cup. Well, not this cup. This is me Freddy cup. But they just took a cup and just did this. They did, they did this to a door. Not that you won't, you won't believe what happens next. This is a, a freaking, oh. The, the epiphany I've just had. This is amazing. I don't have to touch the door. Is that what they're implying? Because that's stupid. I'll leave you alone.